Hey Orion, hope you're doing well. So today I thought we would read uh, Bernard Harris, a different story. So here we go. Bernard Harris was born in Temple, Texas in 1956. At 13, he watched the first moon landing on TV. Harris decided then to become an astronaut. He didn't know that he would be the first African-American in space. When Bernard was young, his family lived on a Native American reservation in Arizona. At night, Bernard could clearly see the stars in the sky. He imagined what it would be like to travel to space. In high school, Bernard Harris decided to become a doctor. He graduated with a degree in biology from the University of Houston in 1978, but Harris didn't forget his early interest in space. Harris worked as a researcher at the Lyndon B. Johnson Space Center. In 1990, he joined the astronaut training program. Harris studied how people felt during long space flights. Harris became an astronaut in 1991. His first space flight was that year. In 1995, he became the first African-American to walk in space. In 1996, Harris left the space program. He started an organization that teaches children about space. Harris believes that nothing is impossible if you follow your dreams. What would you like to learn if you were a space scientist? So that was a short one, but it had a lot of hard words. So definitely feel free to watch it again and see if you can pronounce some of the words. Um, but yeah, I'll record a few more for you. So um, hope you're doing well and yay, talk to you soon.